changing over In the moonlight I can kill this feeling sober So we start to come alive very last cold start of the K20. I'm crippled. You are crippled? Uh-huh. You want to hold this? Yeah. It's not even a sad moment. I'm happy. Get you sure? compression monster out of here. You're going to you're going to be sad though. What? You're going to be sad though. <laughs> the last person in my car was my daughter, so the wiper's going crazy. <laughs> imagine, imagine it just didn't start. <laughs> uh, it's, it hadn't been started in a minute, so it, it, it was a little slow. But uh, yeah, let's go grab some food. And then we'll see. Oh, I forgot, like this is the first time like being in the car with you guys like on camera and everything with my brand new tent. <sighs> yes, we tented the RSX. It's freaking awesome. Get to use my new hybrid shift knob for the first time. It's a little warm, but it's not bad. Eh, not bad. It's a lot better than having a metal one. It's weird not having that weight on there though. It feels a lot more I don't know, stiff. All right, let's go get food. See, I can't do my normal thing where I ask if I can drive. So I literally can't drive for this thing now. That's true. I told myself I wouldn't drive this thing off-road anymore, but here we are. Well, now that it's not super low, it's not that bad. But when it was like on the ground, before we got the coilovers adjusted correctly, it was, I couldn't get, I couldn't pull it off the, the driveway because it would like scrub. <laughs> it took four cars to build this engine. That that 04 CRV that I pulled apart at the LKQ in Huntsville, that that donated a, a lot of parts, you know, valve cover, dipstick, a uh, bunch of bolts, like all pretty much all the bolts that I that were like part of the timing, the timing cover, the timing components came out of that CRV. The 05 here, obviously. Donate, is donating a, a huge chunk of things to that engine. Uh, starter, alternator, the body itself, you know, this is where we're going with it. The poor TSX that the K24 block came out of, really, it just gave me the block. It didn't really give me much else. Um, and the timing cover from the block, so that's, that. The, you know, those two things. The flywheel that I'm having machined came out of my O2 rsx type s and i've had it i've had it since the day i pulled it out ever since i did a clutch job on it because i put a lightweight flywheel in that thing um, but i kept it because i don't know i'm a pack rat but um it worked it turned it worked out well because um when i pulled it out that car only had like 130,000 miles on it and so between the three flywheels i have the one that's currently pulling us along the road here the one I pulled off of Kyle's engine and the one from my O2 it's got the least amount of miles on it Kyle's had almost 300,000 miles on it this one's got exactly 166,002 miles on it and that one had 
have like 100, 128, 130 something thousand miles on it. So it's got, in theory, the most meat. I just need the performance to reflect that. Just wait till you sound like you better when we put the front lip on. Oh, yeah, yeah, the splitter's gonna look awesome. All right, well, that was nice. Back home. I'm going to change camera positions because this is the very last time that this engine's hitting VTEC for a while. didn't work out the way I planned it to but uh that's all right the VTEC kicked in too hard what something smells like it's burning might be the clutch good news we got a new one can you get my crutches yeah that was fun she's good the last ride with the RSX that's it last ride with the K20Z1 Okay, let's swap this thing. Next time on the Snowdrift Channel, we see if I can pull the K20Z1 with as little drama as possible. Okay, so we've, uh, we've jumped the gun a little bit. I got the car up on jack stands. Look, I see. <laughs> That's me and Daddy. <sighs> nice. RBC intake manifold, internal monologue. Brandon, what are you doing? Just go pull the damn engine. Shut up, me. I'm having a moment. Good morning, everyone. Welcome back. Uh, it's another day out here, working on the uh, RSX. And uh, yeah, let's pull the engine out right now. <laughs> 